Dusty, your, your defense obviously played great tonight. How do you evaluate uh, A.J. Cole with them working behind him? Well, you know, he, uh, you know, he threw a pretty good game. Um, would have liked to have seen his balls to strikes, uh, you know, ratio better because he was almost one, one to one. But, you know, that's what your defense is for, you know, because uh, they made some outstanding plays. And uh, then our offense, um, you know, came through with some big, big hits and big home runs. Anthony, especially Anthony Murph and um, Zim, you know, continue to shine. So the uh, main thing is that, you know, we won the game. Um, you know, A.J. wasn't as sharp early because um, his pitch count got a real high in the first couple of innings. So we certainly got to work on that. You can really talk a little bit about this lineup, I think maybe early on, about how left-handed you guys were maybe at the top, but for half right-handers like Zim and Rendon, as hot as they are, I mean, what is that? Well, I mean, you want balance. I mean, you know, uh, you know, we were left-handed uh, strong at, at the top, but we had Eaton, and we also had had um, Bryce, you know, and they're not in the lineup right now. So, um, you know, if you can hit, you can hit. It don't matter what side you hit from. So... Uh, especially when you swing the bat well. You mentioned there's a, <coughs> to get some runs trying to make it a little easier on you, and they did in the sixth to get some runs to break up, open a little bit. Just talk about the way you guys kind of came through when you had to tonight. Well, yeah. I mean, you know, Velasquez, he has some good stuff. But, you know, we we jumped him kind of early there, you know, um, you know rather quickly, uh, especially in that, in that one inning. So, you know, that's the kind of offense we have. Um, and if one guy didn't get you, there's no chance that another guy will. And... Or all of them. So, uh, yeah, I mean, I love my offense. What the Jacob Turner's been able to do for you now with mm -hmm. a few different times out of the bullpen, um, does it make it a, a tough call when you had to figure out where is he most valuable to you right now? Well, I mean, you know, right now, um, you know, he wasn't available after he pitched those four innings. And then tonight he, you know, he pitched the two innings. He's available probably for one, maybe two tomorrow. But, you know, we got to kind of, kind of watch it so it, it doesn't um, I'm sure he's happy to be here you know no matter where he fits in and so everybody's worried about where the guys are fitting in uh, but you know we're just worried about winning you, uh, you obviously watch Barnes play every day um, but what Zimmerman's done through 30 games just how would you just well that's what I was thinking about in the dugout I mean that's that's Bonds like you know but uh, you know he continues to stay on the ball uh, he's been hot for an extremely long period of time, but you know we got to watch him. You know we, uh, I give him days off from time to time to, to make sure he doesn't tire, make sure he doesn't, you know, because uh, when you're tired, then you end up getting hurt sometimes. And you know with his history, we got to keep him healthy. And he's probably not playing tomorrow. We got to play Lynn, you know, tomorrow. Um, so um, and Lynn's been doing the job too. So, I mean, this is as good a start as anybody that I've ever seen. I know you guys aren't perfect as a mm -hmm. team, but you're 21 and 9, which is the best 30 game start this franchise has ever had. Mm -hmm. um, what do you think it says about the overall talent ability that you guys have that even when things haven't gone 100% perfect, that you're 21 and 9? Well, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I, I look at the records and stats and everything, but, you know, we just got to, we got to keep grinding. You know, there's no time to sit back and see what you've done. You got to think about after you've done it, then then you try to improve on it and do it. And uh, you know, I think about the games that got away we should have won. That's the way I look at it. So, uh, and when things are going good, you get greedy. And uh, so, you know, right now we want to win. You know, every game. You know, it's not going to happen. But um, I mean, these guys got a great attitude. You know, they play hard every day. That's all I ask them and they play smart on most days.